the causes tonight are uh, diabetes and obesity. Any uh, personal connection for you that makes it extra meaningful to be here supporting the cause? Yeah, my, a lot of people in my family, I come from African-American family, southern roots. We definitely ham cocks. So we know how to make anything healthy unhealthy. Collard greens, sweet potatoes, fried chicken. Um, and to be honest, um, my mother, as she gets older, it, I can see how those bad eating habits have really caused her to have struggle in her older ages. And so for me, I'm like, as a track and field athlete that's training for the 2016 Olympic Games, I'm like, you know, family, like, let's eat well together. Let's make this a fun family thing. Eating healthy is not, not taste, doesn't mean it has to not taste good. It's a fun thing that the family can do together. And you know that you're ensuring that you can spend more time with your family down the line and that whenever I have children, my mom's gonna be there to be a grandmom, you know? And so I think that Sports Spectacular is doing an amazing thing and making this a lifestyle. A lot of people say diet as opposed to life practice. So good eating habits should be a life practice. On race day, do you have uh, a, are you superstitious about what you eat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to have a really bad habit. And a lot of times athletes do this. Um, they will try to starve themselves <laughs> and they will like think that not eating a lot is better. But it's not about not eating anything. It's about eating the right things. And so I, I went from not wanting to eat anything before race day to making sure I get potassium. Potassium really good for fighting body cramps. Um, or eggs, it's really good for protein, and it, it really, it doesn't weigh you down, but it lasts throughout the day. Um, I try to stay away from bagels, they're empty calories. So, yeah, it's all about being confident about what you've put into your body so that when you're ready to put out with your body that you feel like you're ready to go. After the season, do you have a particular cheat food that you look forward to? Yes, <laughs> I love In-N-Out Burger. Um. <laughs> and what do you order when you're there? Oh, animal fries, cheeseburger, um, well, cheeseburger, animal style, and then the animal fries. I'm not much of a milkshake person, so I usually just get a lemonade. <laughs> so you can binge on those? <laughs> After the season's over. Um, and sometimes, like with my diet uh, or lifestyle, um, I have a cheat day like one Sunday a month or two Sundays a month just so that um, I can show my family like we can eat the fun things together. It's just being having moderation, you know? Yeah.